七クマ。Good morning, my u r i s a m a Good morning. Good morning. She's gorgeous. Her aura is different from ours. She's drawing a lot of attention. I'd expect nothing less from her. She's the hottest girl at school, Mayuri Shinomiya. She's a second year student who has great looks and motor skills and receives good grades. Plus, she's the daughter of Shinomiya Industries. She's so perfect that you'd wonder how much God loves her. If I need to point it out, she's a bit arrogant. Well, it's more like she's selfish. Well, I'm a first year student, so it doesn't matter to me though. I'm Yuto Kashima. As you can see, I'm a plain introvert. My hobby is reading. I'm good at studying. I'm quiet and don't have any friends. However. Are you okay? Shinomiya sama? Ka Kashima? Are you hurt? No, let go of me. Where are you touching? Huh? I'm not touching any part of your body I shouldn't. Y you're touching my body anyway. That's a bit of a stretch. I put her down and took a good look at her. It seems that she's not hurt. I'm relieved. What? Hmm. It's good that you're not hurt. It's no good. Huh? Did any part of your body take damage? My heart. Huh? Mayuri sama, are you okay? Y yes, I'm good. Thank you. I'm relieved. Are you a freshman? Yes, I'm Yuto Kashima. Shinomiya sama called you Kashima. Does she know you in some way? Well, yeah, kind of. Actually, she knows me well. Whatever, you were great earlier. You're big and buff. Do you belong to any club? Nope, I'm busy after school. Oh man, I want you for my judo club. Our kendo club is recruiting too. Think about it. Thank you. Mm, come in. Excuse me, milady. Kashima. As you can see, I work as a butler in this mansion. In other words, Mayuri Shinomiya is my master. The head of the family took me in to have me become Mayuri Sama's butler and friend when I was small. I'm gonna spend the rest of my life working for the family. But I go to school because he told me to have a lot of experiences. I disguise myself as an introvert in order not to stand out as a guy who works for the family. What can I help you with, milady? About what happened at school today. Oh, that. Sorry. Are you hurt? May I call the doctor? No, that's not. Take it. Huh? Pardon me? Take responsibility. Why? Damn it. I just said it out loud. I'm sorry. Hmm. What do you mean by take responsibility? He touched my body even though I'm not married yet. Don't put it that way. In the first place, that was an accident. It's not like I wanted to touch your body. But, but you did, even though I'd never made physical contact with a man. A man? I'm a man, but I'm your butler. My heart has been in pain after that. I ended up thinking about you in class too. I've become sick. It's your fault. Take responsibility. But... What do you want me to do? I'll talk to father and mother. Come with me. Sure. We explain what happened to us to her parents. And so, I've become sick because of Kashima. So, she's just fallen in love with him. Yes. She hasn't realized it yet. Did we raise her so carefully that she's too pure? Maybe. It's our fault that she's this pure. They're panicked. Hmm. Is it my fault? Anyway, Mayuri-sama is sick. What should I do? Hmm. Well... After coming this far, why don't you date Kashima? Huh? Honey, don't give them such a reckless idea. Oh, sorry. 
I just skipped the explanation. Mayuri, the pain in your heart might be what we call love. Love? You mean I... We don't know yet. You're confused because you made physical contact with the man for the first time. We raised you carefully, keeping you away from boys to some extent. It's our fault. Yes, you'll deal with men again someday. It'll be troublesome if you make a fuss just because they gave you a bridal carry. So, Kashima is your fake boyfriend from now on. Gain experience with them to get used to men. Kashima is my... But we can do it with someone else! Your heart is pounding because it's Kashima, right? Then, getting used to him is the best way. And we trust him, right, honey? Yes. Kashima is young, but a competent butler. He's also not used to women, so it's good for both of you. If you two are fine with this, I am too. Are you sure? You're gonna be my... I'll be your fake boyfriend. It's just an act. You used to make me do it when we were small. We aren't small now. Then, what do you want me to do? You said take responsibility. They gave us an idea to get out of this situation. We can just try. I know, but... Or, would you like to spend the rest of your life with your heart in pain like this? Ugh! Huh? Maybe Kashima also doesn't understand properly. We raised him at our mansion after we took him in front of the orphanage. Well, let's just wait and see. Okay. And so, Milady and I became a fake couple. That was just an act to me at this point. I was just hoping she would recover from her illness. We should come up with rules. We you have your own work as a butler, so we need boundaries for when we're a couple and when we're not. Sounds good. Then, why don't we act like a couple at school? Doing it at home is difficult for us. I agree. I can do it all the time when I'm not working. But our grades are different, so we'll have to meet up at school. You mean, we'll meet up at lunchtime and go home together? Yes, but... Milady, do you want to see me outside of school too? Hmm, I wouldn't say I do. We'll be together at both school and home. But you're not my butler when you're at school. So, changing the way you deal with me at school is the best. That's a good point. Then we'll be a couple at school for a while. Okay. And what would a couple do? I'm not sure. You don't know? Considering what I learned from my friends, maybe we should call each other by our first names. Okay, then I'll call you Yuto. <laughs> this takes me back. I know. She's talking about those old days right after her parents took me in. And I was more like her friend, not her butler. This is Mother's Garden. Great, isn't it? Yes. I've never seen this many flowers. I know. I wanted to show you them. Thank you very much. They're really beautiful. <laughs> I'll show you a lot of things you've never seen. Mm. Thank you, milady. We should explore the garden. Come on. Ah, milady, wait up. We used to play together a lot back then. She made me play a lot of characters with her. We explored the garden and played hide-and-seek. Yuto, call me Mayuri, okay? Understood, Mayuri-sama. That's wrong! Don't call your girlfriend Mayuri-sama. But it makes me really sorry. My parents allowed us to play lovers. There's nothing wrong with it. Okay, then Mayuri. Hmm. How do you feel? I... I think it's good. We'll start the whole thing tomorrow. Understood. We started to pretend to be a couple the next day. We started off with meeting up at the cafeteria at lunchtime. I'm sorry for keeping you waiting, milady. Don't call me milady. Sorry for the wait, Mayuri. Ugh. What's wrong? Are you okay? I... I'm good. Let's eat. Huh? Okay. Hmm... I feel uncomfortable. Hmm. 
everyone will look at Mayuri-sama if she's having lunch with an introverted freshman. You think? By the way, why are you wearing glasses? Your hair isn't kept like that usually. Because I shouldn't stand out as a butler for the family. Who taught you that? The leader of us, the butlers. He said, you're kind of attractive, so don't stand out. Are you? He said I am. I've been with you for a long time, so I'm not sure. Oh, I know. Just spend time as your true self this afternoon. I want to know how they will react. I told you, I shouldn't stand out. But you're drawing attention already. It doesn't matter. You're right. I took off my fake glasses and fixed my hair as Milady told me to. And then... Kashima-kun, what happened to you? Well, you know... You're really cool. I thought you were an introvert like us. You traitor. I don't think I betrayed you guys. The whole class paid a lot of attention to me, and it became known throughout the whole school by after school. Mayuri, ready? Oh, Yuto. Ah, he's the attractive freshman. He called her Mayuri. Are they dating? Really? What an attractive couple! Everyone, I'm leaving. See you tomorrow. We stood out more than we thought. Yeah, I'll be back to a plain introvert tomorrow. I think it's too late. Standing out isn't a bad thing. I think a standout butler is problematic. You think so? Hmm, but maybe it's not good to me. Yes. But it's not because you're a butler. It's more like... Huh? The, the girls made a fuss over you, so... Hmm? I didn't understand what she said. So I asked our leader, and then... She's jealous. Jealous? Okay. As I thought, she's in... Normally, I would have made her give up. But Master and Milady are cheering for her. I don't have the authority to stop her. Hmm... What should I do? What do you think about Mayuri-sama? You wanna date her or work for her? Hmm... I believe she would marry someone from a prestigious family. It's beneficial for the Shinomiya family and herself. That's a good opinion as a butler. But if you give it a thought as the boy Yuto Kashima... I'm... She wants you to take responsibility, so you should accept it. Whatever your decision is, I'll cheer for you as the one who's been taking care of you. Okay. At night, Mayuri-sama called me so I went to her room. Excuse me. I... I can't fall asleep. Spend time with me for a bit, okay? Sure. Not as a butler, but as my boyfriend. Then I need to see her careless. You're alone in your room with your boyfriend. Hmm? So we spent time today as a couple. How do you feel? I was a little nervous, but it was fun. What about you? Speaking with you frankly was hard for me. It's ingrained in me. <laughs> You're right. That was odd. You don't have to force yourself to speak with me frankly. I mean, you can be yourself. Okay. And there's something I realized. What is it? I asked the boys in the class to hold hands with me, like shaking hands, but my heart didn't pound at all. But just being with you makes my heart pound. My heart was in pain because it was pounding. Pounding? The girls said you were attractive today. I thought I wouldn't want them to take you away from me. And then I found out that I'm in love with you. Mm. But we shouldn't do this anymore if I'm causing you trouble. Now I know what the pain is, so we don't have to keep doing this. I'm not sure I'm in love with you. I've never looked at you that way. I know. You're very important to me as a butler. I want to serve you for the rest of my life. But as a man, I can't make a conclusion yet. Okay. So, why don't we keep pretending we're a couple? Huh? Are you sure? Yes, 
Of course, if you don't want to, then... Of course I do. I mean, I want to become your real girlfriend. Now you're being honest. That's so you. Zen, we'll keep doing the play, right? Next, I want to go on a date somewhere. Okay, we can do it. I'll leave the rest to you. If you want to quit this fake couple thing, just let me know. Okay. I'll work really hard to make you fall for me by then. Okay, I'll be ready for that. This thing lasts until she graduates from high school. You want to know if we became a real couple? Yuto, hurry up! There's no rush, Mayuri. I'd like you to take a guess. <laughs> 